you know if uh, Cam and Aiden are in daycare? Or... Yeah, Elizabeth asked uh, a neighbor to watch the boys before she left in the ambulance with Jake. Okay. Well, Elizabeth and Lucky have had enough to handle for one night. Um, obviously, I'll go get my son, but um, but uh, Cam, he can stay with me too. The two boys would be way too much for Graham to handle right now. Yeah, you're right. Well, Cameron can obviously stay with me as long as they need, so... Thanks. Okay. Jason. Jason, I'm so sorry. We did everything we could, I uh, promise. No. I know how hard you and Patrick fought. What what happens now? Um, Jake is still on life support. It's up to the parents when to turn the machines off. Well, a little kid is dead, so this just became your top priority. Okay, I need a list of names. Anyone who's pulled over for speeding or drunk driving in the last three hours, particularly the intersection of Lexington and Gable, okay? Thanks, I'll be here. Hey, hi. I need a favor. You gotta let me help. I'll do anything. I'll make phone calls, I'll knock on doors, I'll take measurements down at the scene, anything. Uh, uh, Jason just lost his son. Shouldn't you be with him? Well, Jake is sort of an unloaded subject for Jason and I. I made a horrible mistake years ago, one that I will regret for the rest of my life. Okay, Jason obviously got over that. Yeah, obviously. But tonight, I mean, Elizabeth, I just, I can't. Uh, I have to stay away from the hospital. I mean, I want to be there for Jason, but I can't. So I need to feel like I'm helping in some way. Please. Okay, uh, I'm about to pull up the traffic footage from the camera at the intersection of Lexington and Gable. So a lot of cars could go through that intersection in five minutes. I could use another set of eyes. Great. Hey. Penny. I thought you could use some company. Thank you. It's been an awful night. Oh, well, that's why I'm here. Jocelyn has a, a rare form of cancer. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Um. She has tumors on both her kidneys. She may have to do chemo if we don't get a, a donor for a transplant, which is going to be a long shot. Oh, I look at my sister facing life and death, and I, I realize for the first time what my parents and Jason were talking about. There is nothing worse than fearing for the child that you love. Jake suffered a catastrophic head injury. I want you to know that we did everything we possibly could. I performed a uh, bifrontal depressive craniotomy, and we discovered that there was a uh, There's just too much damage. I'm so sorry. I want to see my son. I want to see. I want to see his. Before they take his body, I need to see him. Jake is still on life support. There's no talking? brain activity. All the things that made Jake, Jake are gone. The machines are keeping him alive. It's up to you. It's up to you to decide when to turn them off. I realize this is a very difficult situation, but I'd like to ask both of you if you would consider organ donation. What? I know how hard this is. 
But the time is now. Jake can save the lives of many children. Look, he was trying to be strong. When Jason told him, I don't know, I can't stop thinking about Jake. I just, I can't believe this. I need you both to do me a favor. I, uh, I don't want you to tell Daddy that Jake was Jason's biological son. It's not for us to tell. That killing old man. Well, like he will survive this. He will. I don't know how, but uh, he will. Would you be able to stay with Elizabeth for a while? I need to get him. They're talking organ donation. I'm sorry. I need to see Jake before I sign any papers. Yeah, uh, they, they've moved him to room 1050. Two more, but this last one's giving me trouble. Well, just enhance the image. Thanks. I'm trying to, but it's uh, oh, wait, it's coming up green. Right there. Yeah. Okay. Got it. VG one XKB. All right. That's the last car to go through the intersection between eight and eight oh five. Okay. Well, if we can eliminate the neighbors, the odds are whoever hit Jake or one of those seven vehicles. Right. So we need to figure out who the drivers are and which one did it. They were counting on me. Elizabeth is a friend, and I wasn't good enough. Jake was already too far gone. I dedicated myself to medicine. I went to all the best schools. I sacrificed to be the best. And I wasn't good enough. Did 
you do this on your own? And I was coming to wait with you, and when I got there, I couldn't believe it. I can't believe it. I would give anything to bring Jake back. You know, I can... I can count the times I ever held him. Eight. You know how much you love your son. Uh. That you would do anything for him. Too, and she's really sick and we didn't know it. She has cancer. And she needs a kidney transplant. 